Okay, hello everyone. So now we have seen the structure of blockchain. We have also seen that the chains are tied together using hash. But what happens when I send a blockchain uh, transaction or Bitcoin transaction to someone? That means if I am transferring some Bitcoins from my account to someone else's account, what happens internally is that uh, I, will, I, will, I, will, I will broadcast it to everyone that I am transferring 0.1 Bitcoin to Vinod. That's it. So basically the blockchain is a network of nodes and these nodes are connected internally to each other. Once I will send uh, the Bitcoins uh, to someone, let's say Vinod, I will contact the nearest node which is connected to the blockchain. So far so good, I may be the one that is also sending, that may be one of the nodes. So I will propagate to the other nodes, they will propagate to everyone, they will propagate to everyone inside the network. In very very short amount of time, everyone knows that this transaction I have specified. It is also the fact that whenever there is a next block to be proposed, Whoever is proposing a new block, they will have various uh, unspent transactions. That means uh, these are the transactions which are not noted down in the blockchain till now. So far so good. Now there are various transactions, everyone is sending to multiple parties and these, these multiple parties are, uh, are broadcasting to everyone and whoever is proposing a new block, uh, they have a lot of transactions which are not there in the blockchain now. Now the concept here in the blockchain is that there is someone who is proposing a new block. It's just like that. Uh, we want to make sure that who will uh, who will who will decide uh, regarding uh, regarding uh, the next trip. So everyone will say something, 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 something. But in order to decide something, first of all, we will decide who is uh, the monitor, and that monitor, whatever he will say, will accept it. Up. That's the same same thing in a class. In a class. Instead of accepting that uh, this is this is this are are the are the are the options for getting to the next trip, we will say that let us elect a person and that person whatever he says we will accept it up after due diligence. Now, how to elect a new person uh, in a class? There are various schemes, but what scheme does does Bitcoin use in a proof of work scenario? They they allow us that whoever does the maximum work will be selected. We will come to various schemes of election very very soon but consider the fact that we have elected someone and that elected someone, some node proposes a block and that block will contain some of the unspent transactions. The transaction may be mine that I have spent something to Vinod that is a part of that block and that block also contains the hash of the previous block that is communicated to everyone across the network and once it is communicated to everyone across the network, everyone will verify that yes this is a good one uh, following all the properties and then that particular block is accepted by everyone as the part of that blockchain. And again it is important to know that everyone agrees to this particular copy simultaneously. And if someone does not agree simultaneously then of course whatever is the current state is communicated to across everyone that yes we have accepted this. Now you now keep on building from this block onwards because you have to add the hash of this block to the next block as well. So in order to summarize, yes, I have spent something, this is a transaction and there are various other transactions in the across the globe. They will be propagated to the network of blockchain uh, which is built on top of the internet. That is, a, that is a platform in which whenever somebody proposes a new block, we will decide who will propose a new block and once someone proposes a new block, in that block my transaction would be there where everyone will accept that yes, I have spent something to Vinod and after that point of time, Vinod can use those 0.5 Bitcoins to spend it to someone else as well. Thank you so much.